Welcome in everyone. Hope you guys are having a fantastic day. I'm Franco Javier M and today is Monday, November 28th and we have FIFA 23 6 p.m. content today. I'm gonna load up into foot here. All right, so first things first, let's go into SBCs and see what we got today. So, um, we have Leo Messi still there, Christian Eriksen still there, Moise Keane, 85 plus double upgrades. Um, let me see what else did we get. What's today? Today's Monday. I'm not entirely sure what we get on a Monday. FIFA World Cup Challenge Tunisia. Complete the FIFA World Cup Challenge to earn a reward. Mix players pack. You get two rewards actually. You get an 80 plus World Cup three players pack. It's also untradeable along with the mixed players pack. But let's check it out. So for this you need four countries minimum. Players from the same country maximum four. Clubs minimum three. Team overall rating minimum 65. Total chemistry is minimum 13. And the number of players in, in the squad is 11 um for a mixed players pack i think right so let me just whoops let me just double check mixed players pack the yeah untradeable and then the world cup pack as well so not too bad there what else did we get year in review player pick okay earn one of two players that were released exclusively through sbcs and objectives in FUT 23 in october not including icons and it's repeatable and you have three days to complete this there's only one segment. What did we get in October? I honestly don't even remember what we got in October. Um, 86 and higher overall players, minimum two. Team overall rating is minimum 84. Number of players in the squad is 11. I'm trying to think in October. I think, well, player of the month, Cody Gakpo, I think it was. Uh, player of the month, Valverde, maybe? I don't know. I can't remember, honestly. Messi was a player of the month. I don't remember if he was in October. Um, I'm trying to think. Promos out of position players. Who was in SBC there? Ansu Fati, but he's still available. I think he's still available as an SBC. Um, Insigne. Insigne was a rule, rule breaker. So I remember that one. Real, rule breaker Insigne was one. Um, and then in terms of objectives. Once to watch. No. That was September I believe. So yeah, I really don't remember. I'm trying to think. But anyways, this is a year in review player pick. That's what you got to do for it. If you guys do this, good luck on uh, on your pack luck. Daily login is there again. Make sure to do daily logins. As always, it's always just a bronze. So always remember to complete your daily login. Anything and icons. Ooh, Bastian Schwansteiger World Cup icon um, SBC. Yo, you have 29 days to complete this let's take a look at him can we take a look at him yeah we can okay so he's high high work rates he's three star three star i don't know what his regular icon cards if they're the same skill moves same weak foot same work rates um he's six foot uh he's six foot he's got 75 pace 85 shooting 88 passing 84 dribbling 86 defending 87 physicality i don't know if this came out yesterday this is the first time i'm seeing it uh, his alternative position can, is LM. His his preferred position right there is a CM that you see on his card. I love the icon uh, picture there. Him kissing the World Cup. That's so amazing. The World Cup trophy right there. Um, his overall stats here. He's got 83 finishing, 86 attacking positioning, 92 reactions. His um, defensive awareness is at 86. He's got good passing stats, short passes to 91, good stamina of 92, 84 strength, um, jumping ability is 86, 90 interceptions on defending. Um, so very cool, very cool. Long passer trait, long shot taker trait, playmaker trait, and team player trait. Very cool, very cool. I guess if you're a Schweine fan, if you are German, or if you're a Bayern Munich or whatever, um, Man United fan, I guess, because he did play for Man United a bit, you would complete him. Maybe I I don't know. I have way too many too many center, central midfielders, way too many on my team. So I don't know if I'll complete them, but for the first two segments, you need a bronze rares and a silver rares, and for those you get two rare gold players pack in return on both of those segments. The next segment is for a small gold players pack tradable, and you need one Bayern player in the squad and minimum ratings 83. The next one is minimum German player, just one minimum German German player in the squad. Overall rating is minimum 86, and you get a jumbo premium gold pack. And then finally, top notch, one team of the week or foot champs player in the squad, and then the overall rating is an 87, and you get a rare election players pack. That's actually not that bad. For a World Cup icon, 
and um and a 90 rated right I don't think that's entirely too bad. All right, so I guess that's all we got for SBCs. Let's go over here to objectives, history, mystery lesson. This came out over the weekend. Black Friday Cup is still there. Uh, Toko Kambi is still there for another couple of days. Silver B, Silver Stars are still there. We have a couple more days to complete it. Um, doesn't look like we got anything. Oh, FIFA World Cup swaps week three. Let's go. So we have all of these nations to complete in the world's world what is it world cup swaps foot friendly game mode whatever to score six with or no sorry win six with at least six world cup players of each nation and you'll get yourself whatever group they are an essentials pack for them um and then the overall reward is an 80 plus world cup three players pack but more importantly you're getting a swaps token there so you can go claim packs go claim that Vieira or whoever you want to whatever you want to do with your tokens right and then finally we have promo packs um it's pretty much the same over the weekend this one though i want to highlight this one in case you haven't seen this fifa world cup foundations packs contains one world cup swaps token so it is 75k or 500 fifa points and you get yourself a guaranteed swaps token so one of the swaps tokens is in the packs and then along with the swap token, you get 15 rare gold players from Brazil, Netherlands, Argentina, France, or England, in addition to one lone player pick between three lone FIFA World Cup icon players, one lone player pick between three lone World Cup hero players, and five player picks between two FIFA World Cup players. And the loans are untradeable. Or I'm sorry, the loans are for seven days or whatever, seven contracts, like how it always is. Um, but yeah, if you are grinding swaps tokens and you need them for whatever reward you're trying to get, go into the store and buy yourself this pack with either points or with coins. All right, YouTube, that's going to be the end of this video. I'm not going to lie. I'm a little bit disappointed that we didn't get a showdown SBC in between Iran and USA because tomorrow winner of that match gets to advance through to the next stage. Uh, I can't remember who else plays in on tomorrow on Tuesday. I know that England and Wales play, um, but I think the Iran and USA game is a little bit more important just because of that group of who gets to go on to the next stage. Uh, but anyways, I'm a little disappointed we didn't get that. Um, yeah, kind of disappointed. But hope you guys did enjoy the video. Please drop a like. And if you guys are new to the channel, please sub to the channel. And I'll see you guys next time. Laters.